I, I, I've had uh, one uh, or two in particular uh, multiverse experiences where time and reality has changed in a way that I cannot explain. In a stunning revelation that sends shivers down our spines, renowned mycologist Paul Stamets has unveiled a discovery that defies the boundaries of our understanding. After years of dedicated research, Stamets has uncovered a remarkable hint that suggests the existence of an alternate dimension, a multiverse that exists alongside our own, yet is distinctly separate. This newfound realm holds a mysterious allure, promising unimaginable wonders, as well as chilling terrors. As the boundaries between dimensions blur, we find ourselves faced with profound questions and unsettling possibilities. Brace yourself for a mesmerizing journey into the unknown, where reality takes on an eerie twist and the secrets of other universes beckon. Paul Stamets said he had one or two spine-chilling encounters with the multiverse, where time and reality underwent unnerving transformations that defied all explanation. These experiences left him in a state of profound bewilderment, struggling to wrap his mind around their disturbing nature. What made them particularly disconcerting was the fact that they occurred during his journeys with psilocybin, the mind-altering substance known for its profound effects. Stamets couldn't help but speculate that psilocybin might act as a one-way portal, leading unsuspecting explorers into the enigmatic depths of the multiverse. In this eerie realm, the fabric of time twists and distorts, and multiple universes exist simultaneously, each with its own strange reality. However, one encounter stood out among the rest, an encounter so terrifying and inexplicable that it continues to haunt him. The mere thought of trying to convey it sends shivers down his spine. It was a realm of unfathomable horrors, where the boundaries of reality dissolved and the unknown loomed in every shadow. Stamets understands that sharing such bone-chilling tales may invite skepticism and doubt, Yet, with his well-established credibility as a researcher, he dares to delve into these spine-tingling concepts. Regardless of one's acceptance or rejection of his accounts, Stamets reminds us that the absence of an explanation does not render an experience any less real. The reality, it seems, extends far beyond the confines of our everyday perceptions, revealing its sinister beauty to those brave enough to explore its chilling depths. How the Multiverse Affects on Time and Reality The concept of the multiverse has long fascinated both scientists and enthusiasts of science fiction. It presents a fascinating idea that our universe may be just one of countless parallel universes, each with its own set of physical laws, dimensions, and realities. The implications of such a vast multiverse extend beyond imagination, profoundly affecting our understanding of time and reality. In the realm of time, the multiverse theory challenges our conventional understanding of a linear timeline. In a single universe, time typically moves forward, flowing in a continuous sequence from past to present and future. However, within a multiverse framework, time becomes more complex. Each parallel universe within the multiverse could have its own distinct timeline, running concurrently with other universes. This implies that time itself is not a single, fixed entity, but rather a fluid and interconnected concept across the multiverse. Moreover, the existence of multiple universes raises intriguing questions about the nature of reality. In our everyday experience, reality is defined by what we perceive through our senses and the laws of physics that govern our world. However, in a multiverse scenario, the possibilities of reality become boundless. Each universe within the multiverse could have different fundamental constants, physical laws, and even dimensions. This means that what we consider real in our universe may not hold true in other parallel universes. The multiverse theory also challenges the notion of a singular reality by suggesting that all possible outcomes and events are realized in different universes. This concept, known as the Many Worlds Interpretation, proposes that every decision or event branches off into separate universes, creating an infinite number of realities. For example, in one universe you might have chosen to travel to a different country, while in another universe you might have made a completely different decision. 
This idea suggests that there is no single fixed reality, but rather a vast tapestry of interconnected possibilities. The multiverse theory's impact on time and reality extends beyond theoretical musings. It has implications for cosmology and our understanding of the fundamental laws of the universe. By studying the multiverse, scientists can explore the origin and evolution of our universe and potentially gain insights into the nature of dark matter, dark energy, and the fundamental forces that govern our reality. However, it's important to note that the multiverse theory remains a speculative concept, lacking direct empirical evidence. While there are theoretical frameworks, such as inflationary cosmology and string theory, that support the existence of a multiverse, Further research and experimentation are necessary to validate these ideas. In conclusion, the multiverse theory challenges our traditional understanding of time and reality. It suggests that time is a fluid concept that extends beyond a linear sequence, and reality encompasses an infinite array of possibilities. While the implications are profound, it is crucial to approach the multiverse theory with a scientific and open-minded perspective. Where you ignore what the scientists say, and you do your own kind of thing. And in retrospect, the kind of multiverse that is being used in Hollywood is more like the philosophical idea of the set of all possible worlds. Recognizing that it remains a fascinating hypothesis awaiting further exploration and evidence. The concept of parallel universes. Parallel universes aren't just a part of good science fiction stories anymore. Some science theories now back up the idea that there are similar worlds outside of our own. The multiverse theory is still one of the most debated ideas in science, though. Our universe is so big it's hard to imagine. Hundreds of billions, if not trillions, of galaxies, each with billions or trillions of stars, spin through space. Some scientists who study models of the universe think that the universe might be 7 billion light-years wide. Some people think it could go on forever. But is that all there is? Science fiction loves the idea of a parallel universe and the idea that we might be living just one of an endless number of possible lives. But multiverses aren't just in Star Trek, Spider-Man, and Doctor Who. Real science theory looks into and sometimes supports the idea that there are other worlds outside, parallel to or far away from our own, but that are similar to ours. People often argue about multiverses and alternative worlds in the same way they argue about the Big Bang, string theory, and quantum physics, which are all important scientific ideas. Before about 13.7 billion years ago, everything we know was a very small point. Then, according to the Big Bang theory, it went into motion and expanded faster than the speed of light in all directions for a tiny fraction of a second. In a process called cosmic inflation, the universe grew to be 1026 times as big as it was before 10. 32 seconds had passed. All of this happened before the actual growth of matter, which we generally call the Big Bang and was a result of all this inflation. As the expansion slowed, a rush of matter and radiation came out, making the famous Big Bang fireball and started to form the atoms, molecules, stars and galaxies that fill the vast space around us. Some scientists are sure that there is more than one world because of the strange way inflation and the Big Bang work. Alexander Vilenkin, a theoretical physicist at Tufts University in Massachusetts, says that inflation didn't end at the same time everywhere. Even though it stopped everywhere we can see from Earth 13.8 billion years ago, cosmic inflation is still going on in other parts of the universe. The name for this idea is the theory of eternal inflation. Vilenkin wrote in 2011 for Scientific American that when inflation stops in a certain place, a new bubble world forms. Because they keep getting bigger, these bubble worlds can't talk to each other. If we tried to go to the edge of our bubble, where it might touch the next bubble universe over, we'd never get there because the edge is moving away from us faster than the speed of light and faster than we could ever travel. But even if we could get to the next bubble, endless inflation, mixed with string theory, says that our universe, with its fundamental laws and conditions for life, could be very different from the next bubble universe. This picture of the universe, or multiverse, as Vilenkin called it, explains why the constants of nature seem to be just right for life to start. The reason is that intelligent viewers only exist in those rare bubbles where, by pure chance, 
the conditions are just right for life to form. The rest of the multiverse is still empty, but nobody is upset about that. Vilenkin's reasoning makes it sound like there could be other intelligent viewers in some of the endless bubble universes outside of our own. But every second that goes by makes us farther from them, and we will never meet. The wave function in quantum mechanics, and how it changes when observed or measured. In the strange world of quantum mechanics, the wave function is like a magical description of a quantum system. It tells us everything we need to know about the system, such as where it is and how it's moving. We represent the wave function with the symbol psi. When we're not looking at a quantum system, its wave function evolves smoothly and predictably according to the Schrodinger equation. It's like a wave spreading out and exploring all the possible states of the system. This means that the system can exist in multiple states at the same time, which is pretty mind-boggling. But as soon as we make an observation or measurement on the system, something strange happens. The wave function suddenly collapses or changes. It's as if the system decides to reveal just one of its possible states. The collapse is random, and we can only predict the probabilities of different outcomes. Imagine you're trying to catch a ball in the dark. Before you turn on the lights, the ball could be anywhere within your reach. It's like the wave function spread out over all the possible positions of the ball. But as soon as you switch on the lights and observe the ball, it collapses into one position that you can see. You've measured its location. Similarly, when we measure a quantum system, it interacts with the measuring device, causing the wave function to collapse into a specific state. The result of the measurement corresponds to one of the possible outcomes, and the system chooses that outcome randomly based on the probabilities encoded in the wave function. This process of wave function collapse is known as the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics. It's like the system making a choice when it's observed. However, there are other interpretations, like the many worlds interpretation, where the wave function doesn't collapse but branches off into different parallel universes, each corresponding to a different outcome. To summarize, the wave function in quantum mechanics describes the state of a system. When we're not looking, it evolves smoothly and explores all possible states. But when we make an observation or measurement, the wave function collapses, and the system reveals just one of its possible states. The outcome is random, and the probabilities are determined by the wave function. It's a mysterious and fascinating aspect of the quantum world that scientists are still trying to understand. The Multiverse Theory Suggestions The multiverse theory suggests that there could be many other universes besides our own, these universes might have different laws of physics and conditions compared to what we observe in our universe. One idea within the multiverse theory is the concept of an infinite multiverse. This means that there could be an unlimited number of universes, each with its own unique set of physical laws and properties. In an infinite multiverse, it becomes highly likely that there would be universes that are similar to ours or even contain exact copies of ourselves, called doppelgangers. This is because, with an infinite number of universes, every possible combination of particles, energy, and events would be repeated over and over again. However, it's important to note that the multiverse theory is still a subject of scientific study and debate. Scientists are actively researching and exploring this idea, but there is currently no direct proof or evidence for the existence of other universes. The multiverse theory has gained attention in fields like string theory, cosmology, and quantum mechanics. It offers a possible explanation for why the fundamental constants of our universe appear to be finely tuned for life. It also raises questions about the nature of reality and our place within the larger cosmic landscape. Overall, the multiverse theory suggests the possibility of many other universes with different physical laws and the potential existence of identical or similar versions of ourselves in these universes. The multiverse theory suggests that besides infinite universes and doppelgangers, there are other interesting ideas. For example, there could be universes with different laws of physics and constants, leading to diverse properties. Cosmic inflation, a widely supported concept, is related to the multiverse theory and proposes that different bubbles in the early universe could have evolved into separate universes. Quantum probabilities also play a role as each possible outcome of a quantum event might occur in a separate universe. 
The anthropic principle explains that our universe's properties allow for the existence of life, and the multiverse offers the possibility of other universes with suitable conditions. Additionally, some versions of the multiverse theory suggest an eternal inflationary state where new universes continuously form. While these ideas are still speculative and debated, scientists are actively researching and testing them. Evidences for Parallel Universes Number 1. Cosmic Ray Detection Cosmic rays are high-energy particles originating from space. Some scientists speculate that if parallel universes exist, they could interact with our universe through cosmic rays. By studying the properties and patterns of cosmic rays, researchers hope to find anomalies or deviations that could indicate the influence of parallel universes. Number 2. Gravitational Waves Gravitational waves are ripples in space-time caused by massive cosmic events such as black hole mergers or supernovae. It has been suggested that if parallel universes exist, gravitational waves might exhibit specific signatures or patterns that could indicate their presence. However, no definitive evidence has been found yet. Number 3. Cosmic Microwave Background CMB. The CMB is radiation left over from the early universe. Some physicists speculate that if parallel universes exist, they could have left an imprint on the CMB in certain ways. By analyzing the CMB data for unusual patterns or anomalies, scientists hope to find indirect evidence of interactions between our universe and other parallel universes. Number 4. Multiverse Theory The concept of parallel universes is often associated with the multiverse theory. This theory suggests the existence of multiple universes, each with its own set of physical laws and properties. While the multiverse theory is supported by mathematical models such as inflationary cosmology and string theory, direct empirical evidence is still lacking. Number 5. String Theory and Brain Cosmology String theory proposes that our universe is a three-dimensional brain embedded within a higher-dimensional space. Within this framework, other brains representing separate universes could exist parallel to our own. However, empirical evidence supporting the existence of these brains or parallel universes is currently lacking. Number 6. Quantum Mechanics and Many Worlds Interpretation The Many Worlds Interpretation in Quantum Mechanics suggests that every quantum event leads to the creation of multiple universes, branching out to encompass all possible outcomes. Although this interpretation implies the existence of parallel universes, it is currently a matter of theoretical speculation and has not been directly observed. Big Bang Discovery Opens Doors to the Multiverse Scientists think that the ripples of gravity left behind by the cosmic fireball show that we live in a multiverse, or a world with many universes. Because the gravitational wave results point to a type of inflation that was especially strong and common in the early universe, this inflation was an exponential growth of space to many times the size of our own universe in the first fraction of a second after the Big Bang, which happened 13.82 billion years ago. Basically, the BICEP2 team's findings show that the process that makes the universe bigger looks too powerful to happen only once. Instead, once a Big Bang starts, the process would happen over and over again in different ways. That means that after the Big Bang, there is every kind of universe out there, from our familiar universe full of stars and planets to extravaganzas with many more dimensions, but no atoms or photons of light. In this chaotic, inflation-made world, the Big Bang is just the beginning. It gave rise to many universes, including our own, that are divided by distances that are hard to imagine. This means that there are other universes far beyond the 92 billion light-year width of the universe we can see. These other universes have many more dimensions, different physical features, and different paths. The multiverse may even help explain one of the strangest things about our world, which is that we are here to see it. This is sometimes called the anthropic concept. Cosmologists think that our universe seems too good for life. Without its Goldilocks perfect arrangement of physical factors, like how strong the force holding electrons to atoms is and how weak gravity is, there would be no planets, suns, biology, or life. If our universe was the only one made by the Big Bang, these things that make life possible would seem impossible. 
But in a multiverse with billions of universes, a small number of universes that are good for life would happen to pop up by chance, and we could be living in one of them.